Here we have a vintage Eastern Germany, as you can see right here, made in GDR, which is a German Democratic Republic, which is not Western Germany. This is part of Russia during the time. But this is a tin intercontinental craft, the KLM design, if I'm not mistaken. As you can see, it's got the original box. It's in good shape. We'll open it from this end. Is the original insert, as you can see, it's in good shape. Which did wonders because it kept the plane in beautiful shape. Very simple. This is a friction driven model, right here. So, all you do to put this together is very simply put the wings on the fuselage on the bottom, push them in, lock it in, and there you have it. It's solid tin, again, it is friction. You can see it works perfect. The front wheels do steer in one way, just slightly, but they do steer. It's got 10 engines in the back. It's about 14 inches in length with a 12 inch wingspan. As you can see, there's no dents, no dings, no corrosion at all, no pits. This is actually new old stock. I do have, I think, 10 of these. I did have a master box with them, so they're all exactly the same. The only difference is sometimes the box may have a small tear or a dimple someplace on it. Um, this particular one, there it is right here. The rear fin sort of did that. It happens to all the boxes, so all of them are not perfect, but they are far from imperfect. You're looking at exactly what you're going to get. And I think if it's time, oh, no. one more note, the wings are also made out of tin. The entire plane's body is tin, as you can see. The only plastic would be the wheels, the engines, and the rear fin on the very end of the tail blades there. The rest of it is 100% tin. And again, this is one of those rare items made in Eastern Germany versus Western Germany. Thank you for your time.